big moves, surprising transfers, and last-minute deals, the latest transfer window has been nothing short of thrilling. Stay tuned as we break down the most significant transfer news from across the football world. Let's dive in. Welcome back to my channel, your ultimate source for all things football. Today, I'm bringing you the latest and most exciting transfer news. From blockbuster signings to under-the-radar deals, we've got it all covered. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates. Let's kick things off with the Premier League, where the profit and sustainability rules deadline has passed. Clubs have been busy making strategic moves to balance their books while strengthening their squads. Man United can finally complete £197 million transfers as Eric Ten Hag sanctions three new signings. Manchester United have endured a very busy start to the summer transfer window, and it's only going to get busier for Eric Ten Hag. Though Ineos making a final manager decision took up some time, United have been active since it was revealed Ten Hag would be continuing as the club's head coach. Everton defender Jared Branthwaite has been the main name linked to an Old Trafford switch with Benfica starlet Joao Neves as another. Unfortunately for United though, they would likely have to fork out £170 million to sign both and that appears unlikely given Sir Jim Ratcliffe's strict stance on new signings. Everton defender Jared Branthwaite has been the main name linked to an Old Trafford switch with Benfica starlet Joao Neves as another. Unfortunately for United though, they would likely have to fork out £170 million to sign both and that appears unlikely given Sir Jim Ratcliffe's strict stance on new signings. Kevin De Bruyne set nerves racing at Manchester City when he admitted he would be more than tempted by the lucrative wages on offer that come with a potential transfer to Saudi Arabia. Clarifying those comments this week, he says he is more than enough money as he continues his typically blunt talk on the subject. But while he confirmed there have been no transfer talks with anyone and that he fully expects to return to City this summer, he repeated that he would consider any transfer if a silly amount is offered. De Brenna, who has just turned 33, is now in the final year of his City contract. There have been no talks over an extension so far, but De Brenna expects conversations to begin soon. From these latest comments, it's fair to assume he won't be leaving the Etihad this summer unless something drastic changes in the next two months. The transfer window always brings a mix of excitement and speculation. As we await the start of the new season, these signings will undoubtedly play a crucial role in shaping the fortunes of their respective clubs. Which transfer do you think will have the biggest impact? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more football updates. Hit the bell icon to never miss an upload. Until next time, stay tuned and stay passionate about football.